Hey yo. So a little something different. Today I've got a Schwinn bicycle lock here that I'm going to attempt to decode. So this is a comb type combination lock. Basically for each of these four rings we have nine closed gates and one open gate. And when the open gate um, is in the top position here, uh, the combs or the teeth in this comb are released one at a time. So we're going to pull and apply tension this way. It's uh, you know similar to picking a pin tumbler lock. We're applying tension, seeking out the binding order. So if this ring is going to bind on this comb the first. We'll work this one, uh, find the open gate, work this one, work this one, work this one, and then eventually hopefully get an open. So right now this combination is set to zero, 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 zero. I'm, uh, this is resettable by pulling up this lever and spinning the dials. So what I'm going to do is just kind of blindly apply a combination by spinning up the dials to reset. Spinning and spinning and spinning and spinning. In all kinds of different directions. Pulling that little lever back down. Uh, then I just need to lock this up. Spin the dial to scramble. Alright, now we've got a locked lock that I don't know the combination to. So, as I said, let's just. Uh, Let's make sure each one is set on a particular digit. Here's our pale line here. And uh, we're just going to watch for uh, gates that feel a little bit different settling in. In some cases, you'll see a little bit more play. Uh, you know, one versus another. Uh, in some cases, we'll see the lock uh, slip out a little bit more. So... Yeah, let's just uh, apply some tension and see what happens here. And sometimes you don't know what you're going to feel. You're just, oh, you're just looking for something that feels out of place. It's, it feels like something ha oh, it feels like something happened there. Let's move on to the next. Oh, good. Let's see, what we got something here. I feel something there. <coughs> and we're missing something. I don't think it's ooh. the first digit. Let's.
All right, so our combination was five, seven, three, three. So we're gonna lock it back up because this lock also has a keyway. Uh, and oddly enough, they paired a relatively crappy low security combination lock with a dimple keyway, a five pin relatively decent looking dimple keyway for some reason. So let's see if we can get it to lock this way as well. Only in seven minutes. Uh, so we can get in here, applying clockwise tension and picking counterclockwise from the outside of the keyway. Oh, 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 oh. We uh, dropped a little bit. Both on my four. Three and and it's just that easy. And we'll probably keep it. So lock that back up. Spin the wheels again. And uh, that's about it. So much for the Schwinn combination dimple pick bite lock. Alright, have a nice day.